Hey, you. Yeah, you. I know you see me, boy. I know you watching this damn video, Alki. These Ganon exams would have been much easier if I had my eyes, bro. So what are you doing? Give me my damn eyes. Alki, man, you think I'm playing around? Huh? Huh? You think I'm playing around? I swear to God, you better give me my eyes soon. Before I really go Thomas Tufferson on you, man. Fact. Believe it. Look, bitch, it's the rap game, Hokage. My bitch is a tension, but I cut it all soon. Fuck up out of my face. Hey. Tell him, give me my space. Hey. My girl, let me uh -huh. say your hey. bitch be like the what right cock. All right, y'all, so we're back in another video, but before this video starts, you got five seconds right now to like it up. Hey, man, if you like this daily Naruto Mighty content, go ahead and subscribe to the channel, okay? There's a few days left in July, but I think if we grind hard enough, we could get to 80,000 subscribers. As you can see that I'm E5 right now. Um, I will drop a video out soon explaining how ranking goes and my E rank experience and Mighty and all that kind of jazz. So hopefully, you know, you guys enjoyed this Mighty content. I already told you I'm going to upload so much Mighty, bro. I've been having so much fun on this game. I have Phoenix Flyer here. I might as well just show off my current Jutsu. So Dragon Song, it's pretty much... Uh, two dragons that auto aim and it does a good amount of damage so it's really good fireball you've seen it already flamethrower longer you hold it you know it just burns obviously forward strike so people always ask me you don't even use your sword nano why would you even have it out and that's because forward strike actually allows you to pull out your sword i only have my sword for the kenjutsu moves as you can see right here so that's why i have forward strike okay I like fist combat better than sword combat, so I'm going to rock with fist, but I do have my sword out just because of the fact that I am using Kenjutsu moves. And Fire Stomp, it's pretty much like Axe Kick, you can see right here. Really good move that I do need to utilize more. If it's something i got to improve on, it's probably Fire Stomping at necessary times, alright? And then Phoenix Flyer, I don't use this because it's utter trash. You can see right there. It does good damage, but like the likeliness of hitting that is just low, okay? It's utter trash. Nobody wants that. And then shurikens, you know I keep the shurikens on me, bro. So there's three pouches in this game. If I didn't explain it already, you press X and you can switch through them like that. So it's pretty cool. Anyways, y'all, before we get started into the actual video, let me explain how the Ganon exams work. You are paired up with a partner from another village. Waterfall and Leaf combine their Ganyan exams together. And pretty much they paired you up with another Waterfall member. I got a Doodoo member. You'll see later on. But <laughs> you get paired up with one and then you do 2v2s. If you won your first 2v2, then you were in the winner's bracket for like the next part of the exams. And pretty much all you had to do was 1v1 your partner. But if you lost, you'd be put in a loser's bracket where you would have to... Um, compete in the losers bracket and if you won the losers bracket you were placed with the winners and then after that you're gonna 1v1 your partner if that makes any sense I mean it'll make a lot of sense once I show you the clip so don't even worry about it let's get started oh. holy crap there are so many people here for this I'm gonna stand next to some fodder yeah do this <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna like stand next to cat oh hell no my dukes there's so many people dude Holy crap. Sure. I think you, think you only have to win one. You only yeah, I only have to win one out of the three fights. I don't have my katana with yeah. me though, bro. Why not? You don't need because it. Because I got, I got gripped by Borgel. <laughs> All right, why don't you uh, buy a new one? Because there's no katanas in Leaf. I had to go to Mist. You got Dragon Song though, so we chilling. Yeah, we chilling. Big facts. How is this going to work, my guy? Real talk. This dude said no beating her weasel in the game, the hell? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my Duke Zenith. He, he's freaking free grips, dude. He is free grips if I queue up against him, so it's fine. <laughs> Wait, is it Waterfall versus Leaf? What is happening, my Dukes? I didn't see oh. or something. They don't have like, they don't have the, oh wait, no, this is getting an exam, so what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> I don't have shuriken, dude! No, if anything, you're, you Bro, probably win, I no? literally don't have shuriken, I gotta stock up on shuriken. Just spam, bro, spam everyone away, you got this. Then go, go with, who, who do you wanna put them with? They're standing each other, bro, look, Hamza and Kent together as a pair. Alright. Kill me. Who is it? Uh, he, he, he wants to go with smoke. He wants to ace, go with smoke. Ace, ace, ace. <coughs> for, for ace, with him. Oh, smoke! Oh, smoke! All right, yeah, so, 
to get. All right, it's my fault. Right, so there, there's you one, two. All right, just put, put these two boys in pairs. Put them in pairs as well. Simple. I'm gonna have to give one person that buy though. Dai Abarame and Sornito is team three. Koji Iburi and Zoe Uchiha team four. Mo Abarame and Lua Uzumaki team five. Net Kurama and Judas Abarame team six. <laughs> Hisao Senju and Kash Shiragane, Team 16. Sianito, Josh Yuga, Team 17. Shiro Abarame, Yami Nito, Team 18. Natsu Abarame, Ace Uchiha, Team 19. Lushi Abarame, Zena Senju, Team 20. Have I missed anyone? All right, y'all. So this was my first ever fight. You can see my partner right here. Interesting thing about this fight was, okay, so my partner decided to take on the Abarame. I took on whatever Waterfall Village clan this is. And my partner actually literally did zero damage. He did zero damage to the enemy, so I was basically 1v2-ing. It, it was, yeah, man, that's actually Thomas Tufferson. But you can see right here, the server was lagging quite a bit, actually. Um, it was a North America server, but it would, like, pink spike. And you can see right there, ooh, my dragon song, bro. I was relying on that damn dragon song the whole time, man. It auto-aims, and it does a decent amount of damage. So it really is a really good move in laggy servers. You can see right here. Boy was stuck in the ground. You know I had to abuse that real quick for the one time, but you can see my partner got dropped, bro. That's actually Thomas Tufferson. That dude was hot. Doo doo cheeks, bro. And then they just started beating up on me, and I couldn't really do anything. Um, I used a dragon song. Uh, I ended up knocking that dude, but I ended up losing anyway. So um, after I lost, I ended up being in a loser's bracket, and you will see the results of that after you see the results of this round, obviously. Like I said, again, the ping was fine, but it would spike a lot because of how many people were in the server. So I'd be at a constant, you know, 60 to 70 ping, but then it would spike up to like 500 in instant. So gameplay was kind of choppy. I don't know if it'll look like it on YouTube, but when I was actually playing, the gameplay was choppy. I tried my hardest to try to um, win this one, but I couldn't. But it doesn't really matter anyways because, uh, spoiler alert, I ended up getting getting in the next two fights. You will see how I rock, man. I was spamming my goddamn shurikens. Try to use Dragon Song right there. Hoped that it knocked him, but it didn't. And I think he gets the dub here. Let's see. Yeah, he does get the dub there with the shuriken. So, yeah. First fight, we lost. All right, man. I had to come clutch right here, bro. In my mind, hey, no pressure, no diamonds, right? No pressure, no diamonds. I had to not fall under the pressure, bro. I had to win. I didn't care how sorry my teammate was. I just had to win, bro. All right. So, you can see right here. I end up taking the Waterfall Villager again, and Waterfall has some interesting clans. This guy could turn into smoke. <laughs> he could literally turn into smoke. As you can see right there, he turned into smoke to avoid my Dragon Song. Really nice by him. I knew after that I was in trouble, bro. Because I did not want to waste my chakra. The last thing I want to do is waste all my chakra on him. Because I didn't have faith in my teammate, obviously. I had to make sure I ended this dude quick, but still had chakra left. Okay? Because I knew my teammate was going to get knocked. It was just a matter of how long my teammate can survive, all right? I was praying my teammate could stall out time so that I could knock my dude before getting to um, my teammate's dude, obviously, because my teammate, he, he wasn't doing anything, bro. <laughs> he really was not doing anything. You see, I go crazy with that flamethrower, though, bro. So with flamethrower, you can hold it, but you can see I just flicker my camera around because all I want from flamethrower is the fire proc. You see how it does burn damage? That's all I want. It keeps the pressure up. You can see right here, it turned into smoke, bro. It caught me off guard, bro. <laughs> It caught me off guard. I hit him with the Dragon Song, though. You can see I'm below half chakra. Turns into smoke. I knew he was low, though. I start throwing my shurikens. That was a really good hit there, bro. I knew he was low now. I think he gets knocked off of this. Yeah, he does. Good thing, though. Good thing is my teammate not only survived. Okay, well, he gets down there. But not only did my teammate survive, but he actually did drain a lot of this Senju's chakra. He drained a lot of legs chakra. So it made it easier for me to fight him because he couldn't sub out of my thing. So you can see I hit him with the... Hold up. He messed up there. Yeah, he folded there. But you'll see I hit him with the 1, 2, 3, 4 air counter, boy. Hold up, hold up. Wait for it. I'm throwing my shortcuts. Hey, man. This fight... Oh, man. If I hit that Dragon Song, it would have been GG's for him. But this fight, bro. Look, watch this. Watch this. <laughs> Big fire stops in the chat, man. I can't... Um, I don't really know when I start comboing up on him. Come on, Nano. Combo up on this dude, bro. Oh, yeah. Like I was saying, though, this fight, I was relying on my shurikens heavy, dude. I was praying that I was going to restock on my shurikens after this fight. But, yeah, I was using my shurikens like my life depended on it, bro. Yeah, look at this, man. 
Hold on. Just wait for it. You can see we just both playing passive. I knew. I knew in my mind. In my mind, I was calm, bro. I was controlled breathing. You know what I'm saying? I was fine, little bro. I was fine. In my mind, I said, hey, no pressure, no diamonds, bro. Heart was not beating it at all. I had to come through for my subscribers, man. Facts. But we're just about to wrap this up. You'll see right here. I hit him with the one, two, three, four launch. Air counter, boy. Now that's Thomas Tufferson. Okay, so I forgot to actually record my last fight, which was against my partner, obviously. Um, you can see, though, like, the clip just explains itself. This dude was hot doo-doo cheeks, bruh. <laughs> dude was hot doo-doo cheeks. Um, I destroyed him quickly. Uh, like I said, again, I couldn't record the entire fight, but I did end up shadow playing it. And, yeah, knock him out like that. Yeah, man, I think this video was short, but hopefully you guys enjoyed it. There's going to be walking around here so I can show you the parkour and stuff like that. But I've been having a lot of fun in Mighty, y'all. I feel like if I keep uploading this, it's going to get so much recognition. And I could really be like a Mighty YouTuber, right? It's been a while since I've recorded a game and solely got popular off of that, okay? I think Demon Journey was my last game doing that. Rogue was beforehand, too. So I really want to continue this. It's not like one of those Naruto games I just record and just straight up quit, okay? I really want to make this a thing where, you know, I upload Naruto Mighty and people when they check out my channel they're coming for Naruto Mighty okay just like how people came for Rogue how people came for Demon Journey how people came for Shinobi Life how people came for Final Stand you know what I'm saying it's not one of those games I want to give up on just yet because I am genuinely having fun on this if you didn't know the game is a closed community game but if you are active in the chat or get a recommendation for the next way you'll be able to play too because I promise y'all man when you see gameplay of this and think it's good playing the game is actually so much better man and if you're the other way around then you definitely need to play the game because at first i didn't think the mighty combat you know what i'm saying the naruto mighty combat was all that until i actually played the game myself like this is one of the games where you have to experience it yourself to find the fun in it beforehand when i used to watch my friends fight in mighty all the time i thought it was you know just normal it was cool i guess but then after playing mighty and after watching them fight again i actually knew the mechanics of the game and what they were doing so i could tell what was good and what was not and it was really fun doing that but yeah man they haven't updated the logs yet but i should have getting soon it was a fun exam uh ggs to my partner even though he was some doo doo cheeks but yeah man <laughs> let me stop man all jokes at the end of the day bro hopefully you guys have a great day though like comment subscribe for more it's been your boy nano and i'm out peace all i gotta do is put my mind to this shit Goddamn. cancel out my ex i put a line through that bitch i like all my asses with two lines